Hello there everybody, Cody here, checking out some uh, more Sea of Survivors. I really enjoy this one. If you haven't seen it, it's the like pirate-themed vampire survivor style. And they added a mode for the Steam Scream Fest, I think is what it's called. So let's check that out and then maybe we'll do another run if it's pretty short. We're in just a rowboat here. Do we have a weapon? Oh god, how do I look at the treasures? Oh god. Wait, am I rowing by pressing the trigger? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Oh god. What am I supposed to do here? Okay, just gotta juke these guys. Alright, we're good. Oh, they're little skeletons instead of pirates on this ship. Oh, that's funny. That's cute. I don't think I have any bearing on how fast I row here, I don't think. Okay. Oh god. Oh, jeez. The anxiety of almost getting hit. Is, it's a bit much. Oh my god. Oh, no, 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 no. What are those things? Oh god, there's an octopus with the boat. Why are y'all with the boats? No! Okay... This is kind of fun, it actually shows off how, like... I mean, y'all aren't playing with- y'all aren't playing it, but it, like, kind of shows off how, like, tight the controls feel in this game. <laughs> They're just pushing the, the squids or octopuses, whatever they are, oh my god. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> okay, we don't want to tilt too much. This is ridiculous. That's so funny <laughs> that they just like... It's like uh, uh, Katamari Damacy where they're like, you know, you're pushing the big ball, but it's... It's the skeletons. Are y'all gonna start? Oh, no, 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 the pup, they move? Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Oh! Okay, all right, all right. Kind of cool. They're like puffer fish, but they look like, you know, like World War II sea mines. Eat. Kind of cool. I like that detail. Yeah. Yes. Hey, I do be rowing. Two, almost two minutes left. Okay. Oh god! Oh god! They're red and they're fast. Oh no! I don't like that. Oh no! They're, my my armor my army is gone. There's one ship left. Thread the needle, okay. This this is kind of fun, I like this. This is a different change of pace. Ugh. I wonder how many hits I can take. I don't have that much health. I'm not really being chased by anything, and I'm faster than that guy, so I <laughs> just pushed him out of the way. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool, though. It just shows, like, you can make all sorts of stuff in all different types of uh, game engines, you know? No! Ugh. Am I supposed to go up? Oh, God. Am I supposed to go towards the arrow? I'm so confused. Oh, no. No! 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 Oh my god, we were so close. Aw, oh, dang it. Oh nice, I made it. Oh, that was much easier this time. Weird. Oh god. Oh, oh, oh! Oh. 
Oh my god, that was close. How long does this last? Will it last for the rest of the run? Is, are those cannon shots? Oh no, I wish I was closer. Is this gonna go on for the full 40, 40 seconds? Is this what peak cannon performance looks like? Yay, we did it! Okay, that was fun. That was a cute little little thing. I like it when they do stuff like that. I don't know why the, the controller doesn't work there. Okay, that was fun. Well, let's hop in. All right, so for those of y'all interested, I this is where we're at meta progression wise. I spent all my money. I had eleven thousand gold, and I spent it all on on the last upgrade for efficiency for more projectiles because I like projectiles. Okay, so I can't actually hire them. Interesting. All right, that's fine. All right, well we'll just keep her around then. We'll just do a cannon run. Increase bounce. Increase fire rate. Both are tempting, but... It has a default of one, right? Connected over... Only affects chained weapons. Okay, yeah. Okay, oops. On the, the... Touching the mouse made that all weird. Ooh, nice treasure map. So apparently, um, I haven't looked in a while, but I remember whenever I was, uh, whenever the game first got updated, and I was, or whenever it first launched into early access, I was looking at the uh, the Discord, and apparently the map coordinates are always the same. So like, once you know where like an island is, if you know the coordinates, you can apparently just drive there. So well, that'll be fun. I'll probably wait till someone like, <laughs> I don't know, updates a, a wiki or something about it. But, you know, once you know where it is, you can just always, you can just always go there. And it's also got updated. They start with a base pierce, which I don't know. Is there a, is there a difference between bounce and pierce? I wonder, I wonder if they're kind of doubled up on that at the same. Hey, ooh, buried treasure. Nice. I think that means we'll get a relic, right? Pretty good. Relics are pretty strong. Alright, what you got for me? Coins? Oh, it's just a level up? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess damage is what I want then. Wait, so you... Cluster, grow stronger for each linked treasure. Does it mean like in total or is it like what's directly touching it? Because if it's what's touching it, I guess I want to put it here, right? Oh no, that was just my level up. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm the big dumb. Okay, I don't want to get too far away from this. If you get too far away, it'll reset now. Oh yeah, level up again. Um, Projectile speed. And treasure, bloodlust, critical hit damage. Or crit is zero, so that's useless. Projectile speed and range isn't bad, but I think I just want the fire rate to be better right now. Like we want, well, we're gonna want range for sure. It's just like, I would rather shoot more right now. Bounce, yeah, more bouncy. Sounds good. Hey, look at that. I killed, hit four enemies with one shot. Oh, nice. We got another thing. Is the treasure just a level up there? Is that what happened? It says we're done. Uh, critical hit damage, turning speed. Nah, let's go with this again. All right, well, let's grab our map and go to the next island. Yeah, so bounce on this one must mean uh, pierce. Kind of like how in uh, Halls of Torment, you know, you've got 
Boris, right? That's the, like, it does multiple things for different stuff. Um, I'll take a move speed. Yeah, I don't need it to be super strong. I'll just put it down here. No. Oh. Only made me one stronger. More cooldown, more projectile bounce. Chance to critical hit actually sounds pretty nice. Throw that in right here, I think. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. We're, look at us. We're critting already. Look at us. Look at us. I don't know why. Every time I say look at us, I always just think of that. The Paul Ones, Hot Ones edit, where it's just him talking to himself. Look at us. Look at us. More move speed, projectile speed and range. Sounds good. Do I want this to be... I feel like this will be the thing I want to build around. Maybe I put this... For the double relic, you know? Like, have the damage and crits are usually... Well, I feel like I'd rather it be projectiles. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Um... Like, I don't think I care if this gets doubled, right? Tethered, increases projectile speed and range. Yeah, I don't know. Put it over here. I wonder how hard I should be skipping. Because we are kind of limited on slots. I don't know if I want to start now. Oh, I wish I knew which one of these was closer. Are you closer? Oh, it's just a merchant shop. Okay, nice. Well, this will get that quest. I have a quest for this now. Please. Pardon me, fellas. Okay, so we can heal. Reach missing health. Nah. Double the stats, and then I just set it here, and then I'll, I'll just put the very few things I want to put around it there. Yeah. Mostly projectiles is what I'm thinking. Projectile spread? Well, that's just how far apart they fire, right? So it's like a yeah, a little bit better coverage. Um, here, more range actually sounds good. Oh god, the explody ships are here. You love that I don't have to collect experience. Like, the stuff we're missing is gold, but we'll get that eventually. I, I can pretty much consistently make it to the first blue ship at this point. Regardless of what uh, weapon I'm using, it seems like. But I think I'm okay on that regard. Well, without any of the curses and stuff. Maybe next run I'll try that. But I really wanted to do cannon, and I didn't want to, like... The cannon's a little finicky sometimes, like if you're not... You want enough damage. You can only shoot your sides, you know? We'll definitely want a couple more spreads, I think. Um, increased chance to critical hit? Yeah, I'll take that. I don't th think I want that doubled. Like, we should get pretty close just from it being near other stuff. Right there. Fine, we'll get hearts and stuff. I wonder how many other healing stuff there is, because there was the cursed wood there would be an option to help us heal. Interesting. And then the swords have the upgrade. Oh, look at this. This uh, abandoned thing. Um, here. 
Would I want this doubled? Yeah, maybe, just so we're always shooting. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, merchant ship shipwreck. Oh yeah, and look, it's on it's on the rocks. Crashed in. I'll spread. See, I think projectile amount, though, is only increased by, I think, weapon chest, right? More damage? Okay. Double max health, but disable healing. No, thank you. Drop. Double merchant chest? Oh, that sounds crazy, but like, damage just seems so nutty, right? It's so early enough. And I think we're going to be skipping a lot as well. Yeah, let's take that. Although double relics does sound kind of crazy. Okay, I need to find... Oh, there it is. I see it. Ah, oh, god. Dang you. And double health, but disabled healing. You try to just, like... Would you still get your health from the max health upgrades, I wonder? I don't know. That seems risky. Because I imagine that would... D disabled healing makes me believe, like, all of it's turned off. Like, your weapons that can heal. Like, that relic we saw. No hearts would drop. I wonder how that would... I wonder how that works exactly. Huh. That'll be a toughie to win with, I think. For me. Just because you, you, um... Like, you get swarmed. Like, you're gonna take some chip damage unless you have... Like a really, really strong setup. I uh, guess I'll swing back for this heart. Hopefully I don't take damage getting it. Uh... Do I even, like, want it, though? The question I have. And put it here again. Sure. Go. We'll just go absolutely ham on the on the fire rate, I guess. As they are shooting like nonstop now. Did I pick up the heart? I think I did. Yeah, I think I got clipped by some of the swimmers there. That's unfortunate, but it happens. Oh no, oh no, 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 Oh god. Oh jeez. Oh no, it looks like the projectiles are bouncing. Oh god, no. Not like this. Yeah, that was ugly. Might want to grab a turning radius, pick up more crits. Could be good. Sure, I guess. Why not? We deleted that guy. Okay. Double its projectiles, there we go. Gain move speed for each empty linked slot. Oh, interesting. Double the stat increases. So it goes from...
Okay, so let me just make sure I'm doing this right. Yep, three, right? Undo. Put it here. Plus nine, right? Only one weapon is chained double its projectiles. Yep, there we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's beautiful. Okay, so basically... We can take one more weapon, but we can't connect it to anything. Hey, there we go. You dead barrel, Hark. So we want more... Projectile. Well, obviously we still want more projectiles, but more spread would be good, right? Uh, uh, really need more fire rate? I might want to grab some health. There we go. Ramstein shipwreck, huh? I mean we get one of his relics? I've seen that name pop up a couple times. There's just so many little guys. Uh, eh, I don't think I need more of those. Or maybe I do. I want the turning speed, but I don't know if I want to waste a slot on it is the problem. There we go. Damage by a fraction. I mean, ram is just good, right? That solves our front block problem. Okay, um, I'm going to put it here because I don't really, like, the flintlock doesn't get stronger if it's connected to more stuff. So we basically just can't put stuff in the holes right here. Nice. Okay, actually, I think I think that's a dub there. I think this is a win. We should be strong enough at this point. Or it doesn't matter. Uh, more max health. Um, I really need a way to heal is the problem. Cool down, maybe? I only got two slots left for the double, so I kind of want to save those in case I get a double projectile thing. Okay, the sharks do not drop a map, it appears. Okay, maybe this guy will drop one. Nope. Yeah, I do need another range upgrade. Oh, we got a boss somewhere. We can hear him. There he is. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, get wrecked. I think a fire ship. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice. That means we got the wake unlocked. We got Felix the snake recruited. Nice. See, look, now I don't have to worry about what's in front of me. I wonder if we get the spread up high enough, though. It should shoot in front of the ship, though, right? Like, in theory. Looks like we got another merchant ship over here, I'm guessing. I think I want to double it. Right. Put it there.
damage by a fraction of movement speed. Um, yeah, I think I just skip these. I've got very few slots left, and I don't really care. Like we, we, I think our damage is good, so I don't think we need that. But yeah, I think I just skip. Gets us another level up faster, which scales the flintlock pistol upgrade. Yeah, nice. This will get us a weapon, I think. Ah, darn, he hit me. Oh, this isn't even where it was pointing us to go. This is a different thing. Uh, oh, no, our crit is already over 100, so I think we just skip again. I imagine the level up is happening. I'm not sure though. Uh. Oh, that was close. Okay, what do we got? Okay, I guess I take the Ocean Breaker short speed increase when ramming enemies. Which would have made taking the one thing a little better because it would give us the speed, but we've got such limited movement. We've got such limited slots in our we haven't really taken any movement upgrades, so. Like we feel okay. I would like one, I think, rotation one. But that's about it. Armor maybe? Yeah, let's put it here so we can like get it more surrounded. I'll take an armor. Okay, I like the new submarine spawns. The no patch notes said they made it so they spawn further away. I don't feel like I'm like running into them as they spawn now. And it looks like the cannons are bouncing to other enemies. Interesting. Is it having to hit two first and then it bounces? Can't really tell. We got a weapons cast raid, and then there's an elite somewhere. I'm hurting somebody. Oh, there he is. Nice, that pulls in all the money, I think. Oh, weird, the bar has stayed red after I defeated the, the guy. Ooh, nice big heart. Thank you. Critical hit damage is tempting. Earning speed is here. I did. I do feel like I want one of those. I just don't know how important it is. Like, I've got one, two, three, four slots left, and I, I don't know if I want to waste one on turning speed. No. It doubles it, though. Yeah, let's take it. I think I'm out of range. There we go. Betrayal. Very cool. Can't take it. Grapnel on hit. Okay. Ooh, another heart over there. Okay, nice. We got some good healing there. Absolute chaos. Wow, lots of hearts being dropped here. Thank you, game. We've got another boss somewhere. I hear him, but I don't see him. Long finger, eh? I think 
I lost a little bit of health there, but it's fine. We're almost at full, thanks to all those hearts we got earlier. I need, like, more enemies. Like, I'm not able to really show off how much damage I can do. Um, I don't want any of this, do I? Like, more range is tempting, but... I mean, there's only five minutes left. There's not much left time in the run, which is unfortunate. I mean, we can take more damage. I think I'm just gonna skip that. 161. Oh, look, it, look, they're still at 161. Interesting. So does it only work if when it... It's not on... Is it not on level up? Is it on, like, when you put a treasure in, I wonder? Because the, their damage stayed the same. Interesting. Because there's technically a difference between the two, right? Because you get the treasure rewards on level up. But a level up isn't the same thing as plugging something in. Because, you know, you don't have to plug... You can skip it like we just did. Interesting. I wonder if that's intentional. The way it's worded makes me think it's not. And so it's shrapnels and we've got all the bouncies on it. I think this is a temple. The Temple of Temptus. I'll deal with you in a second, buddy. Oh god. Oh, my lanta. Yes! Finally. Plus eight? Oh my god. Skip this. 165. <laughs> so silly. Just absolutely ridiculous. Edmund L. Drinker? What a name. God, you know how much ale you have to be drink for that to be your... Your... A common name or whatever it's called, your last name. That is insane, right? It's like whatever foolery Tom that Tom was up to, you know? To have a whole type of foolery named after him. Man, I wonder what this would look like if I didn't have all the spread on. Would they be even closer together, I wonder? I'm gonna take a spread. I'll plug that in right there. Reach over a hundred projectile spread. Nice. Basically covers the whole sides of the ship. Oh, oh. I did not even see a merchant there. Double max health now. That do under 50 damage now. <laughs> oh my god. That is hilarious. Uh eh, no. We've got one slot left. I only only thing I'm interested in is more projectiles. Okay, so a big heart is worth one health bar. Okay. Yeah. I'm not gonna try to go up there. That looks a little too risky. Weapons cache. Okay, maybe we can get another double projectile here. Ah, absolute chaos. <laughs> Ooh, 
Money! Nice. Let's save this guy before I forget. Herbert Seagull. I wish I could hit B there to, to trigger the skip button, but it's fine. It's not like the end of the world, it's a very minor inconvenience. And nope. Yeah, can't take any of these, right? Because they'll plug in and turn off the uh, pig leg. You're so slow. This is so funny. Yeah, getting getting some movement speed wouldn't be bad. I wonder how it'll be once I get all the... Like, it's one of those weird things where it varies in the game and, like, what's on what you're trying to do on the map and stuff. But movement speed in this one feels pretty good. But I wonder if, like, you'll even need it after you get a couple of the, uh, like, base movement speed upgrades, you know? Very interesting. We'll see. What a, what a silly, silly build. Yeah, I wonder if we if we kept getting projectile spread, I wonder if we would have like been able to surround the ship a little bit better. Like maybe I should have doubled up projectile spread after we got the other one. Cursed wood. Feld Cursewood Isle. Interesting. So is this gonna give me the that cursed wood relic that we saw earlier? It's kind of interesting if each if each relic has its own island you can go to. And we're going to destroy the final boss so quickly. It heal two health a second. Interesting. Can't take it though. I mean, I could take it, but I don't really need Projectile spread, though, actually. Projectile spread might have been worth it, actually. Just to see if we could get it to the front of the ship. Because they are a little too clustered. Yeah, that's actually probably better than more projectiles. Not as fun. Cool looking, but it actually is probably worth it. I guess if I see that before I see a projectile again, I'll take it. Nice, we made a pretty good haul too. We got 7,000 doubloons. Very cool. I really like the level up system in this one. Very unique. Elf Isle. Huh. Got a little stone on it. This is so silly. <laughs> oh my god, I can't get over how ridiculous this is. The Kraken is here. Oh my god. I want to finish Health Island though. Before I kill the Kraken. Nice. I guess it just heals you? Okay, alright. See you later, buddy. <laughs> 24 seconds. That is hilarious how quickly we bodied him. Get hit a hundred times in a run. Nice, unlock some relics. Got some more crewmates. Heal a thousand health in a run? Damn. Earn 10k golden one. Ham, hardtack, rum, citrus ale, fresh water. What? Interesting. Is that... Here? Oh, okay. That's why this was empty earlier. Okay. Neat. Well, there's a lot of treasures. Okay, so the, even though... I have to take them to see... For them to become stashed, I'm guessing? Okay. That gives me an excuse to grab them then. Neat. Okay, I guess... The, I thought that was implemented when I played last time, but I guess not. Okay. Very, very cool. Did we unlock any new meta stuff? It doesn't look like it. Okay, alright. Well, thanks for watching, y'all. I do appreciate it. 
like, subscribe, all that good YouTube jazz, and I hope to catch you in the next one. Thanks for the support, Dr. Who.